Patricia Stark and this is Craving Confidence, the show that helps you build your confidence from the boardroom to the bedroom and everywhere in between. Polls show that most gals dread the search for a new bathing suit as much as having to wear one out in public. And not just ladies who have extra weight on them. Every woman out there seems to agonize over one thing or another. Small breasts, big breasts, full legs, stick legs, bellies, short torsos, long torsos, you name it. Now, you might not be able to change the things that really bug you about yourself instantly, but I've got 15 things that you can do to make the process of buying a swimsuit less painful so that you can move on to more important things like having fun and enjoying yourself. Number one, several weeks before you're shopping or sunning, start dancing around your house in your bra and panties. Yep, you heard me. Get used to looking at yourself in as little clothing as possible. Vacuum, do the laundry, sit at the table, anything. Just look at your body when it's not covered up. This will either help you accept yourself for what you are or motivate you to make a change. Now, if you can't do this in your underwear, do it in last year's bathing suit. Number two, put on your favorite bra and panties and stare at them in the mirror. What is it about the cut of the bra and the panties that you like? If it's the coverage and support, bring them with you to the bathing suit store and ask the experts to find similar structured bathing suit tops and bottoms. Same goes for trying to replace an old favorite swimsuit. Bring it shopping with you. Number three, you might not have the time or the desire to go on a crash diet, but you can prime yourself just a few days before you shop. Just two days of avoiding sugar, alcohol, carbs, and salt can get rid of a lot of bloat, and you'll feel thinner on the day that you shop for that suit. Number four, self-tanner. It's your friend. You know how great pantyhose can make your legs look? Well, putting on self-tanner is like covering your body with pantyhose. It makes you look thinner, gives you a healthy looking color, hides spider veins, blotches, and bruises. It's worth taking the time to practice and get good at applying this. Now, I've tried dozens of them, and my two favorites are Banana Boat Pump Mousse that you can only find on the internet these days, it drives me crazy, I don't know why, and Faux Tan by Bare Essentials. Now, you could also go to the experts for a pro spray tan a day or two before your shopping as well. Number five, shave and moisturize everywhere the night before or the morning of. Nothing makes you feel better than smooth, soft skin with no stubble or alligator dryness. Number six, wear a thong. If you're not a daily thong wearer, today is the day to wear one. It is so much easier to try on bathing suits when you're not in your granny panties. You'll have a much better idea of how the suit will actually look. Number seven, don't get hung up on numbers. Universal sizing is a myth. One company's size eight is another company's size 10 and so on. Try on different sizes and pick the one that fits and feels comfortable and cut off that label when you get home. Don't look at the size. Number eight, find out about the store's return policy. Unfortunately, many stores have the most awful fluorescent lighting in their dressing rooms. I don't know why they do this. You're better off buying several suits, trying them on at home and returning the ones you don't like. Number nine, Shop online or through mail order. Now, most of these stores have no problem with returns. I'll order 10 suits at my own private little try-on session at my mirror at home, and I'll keep the one that works best and ship the rest back, no questions asked. I've had great success with Venus, Vicky's, and most department stores doing this. Number 10, focus on balancing your proportions with color and coverage. If you're bigger on the bottom, draw the eye up with colors and patterns on top, and keep your lower half dark and solid. Flip it if you're the opposite. And number 11, seek out suits with tops and bottoms that are sold separately so that you can mix sizes. And a tankini works well on most figures and hides a lot of flaws. Number 12, black is always slimming. But remember, so is hunter green, purple, wine, and navy. You don't always have to do black. Number 13, bring sandals and a cover-up with you and see how it all works together. Number 14, you get what you pay for, girls. More expensive suits cost more because they're made with better materials and they're constructed better. They're gonna fit you more securely and you're just gonna look better. It's worth the investment. Number 15, focus on your best parts, not your worst parts. Remember, most gals feel exactly the same way you do. Most people are worrying about how they look, not how you look. Join us next time for another episode of Craving Confidence because we're here to satisfy your cravings and sign up for that newsletter so we can help you.